Hi everyone and welcome back. How are you guys today? You guys, I am so excited to be back today because today we're back with yet another NCT Dream Reaction. You guys, look, I'm gonna be honest, I'm a little nervous about today, I really am. Um, Honestly, at this point, I have no idea what to anticipate going forward in this album. I thought I had even like a small inkling in the first part of the album and I was wrong. I was very, very wrong. So now I just, I have no idea. I. It's kind of mind-boggling, honestly, because I haven't heard a lot about individual songs. There have been, actually, that's a lie. There have been maybe one or two where people have talked about in which I have seen the most, um, which I'm really excited to get to. I think one of them is in here, um, and I think the last one is in the last part of the album listen. Um, so those I'm excited about. The other songs in which I haven't heard too much about, so it just, it makes me slightly nervous because if as long as I hear something, at least someone talking about them, I kind of get, like, a sense of what to anticipate going forward, but what when no one's saying anything it's a little nerve-wracking so there's that and yes um now for anyone who may be wondering um we are having to split this album up into three parts only because it is their first full-length album since mark has been back um and so in turn there are a lot of songs um and because youtube honestly has very strict copyright policies i can't do everything in one go um so that is why we are breaking this up into parts and yes and uh very quickly before anyone says anything yes i did pick lyric videos for this i understand lyric videos are not the best they mistranslate things they will assign one part to the wrong person i get that i i really do um i have tried to pick lyric videos in which i think um were good i've read through the comments and stuff like that um if they are not just that they're not right please let me know and yes it's just it's the easiest way for me to do this and yeah um and yeah so anyway you guys we are here we are gonna do this we are listening to three songs today um the first one is titled rocket followed by what is this one um countdown three two one and then a and l um honestly i got no idea no idea but <laughs> we're here and we're gonna do this and yes um so yes let me make sure i have it oh i have i got i got lip gloss on my finger that's cool um let me make sure everything's set up though let's make sure we are recording we are this is good let's pull the video up check the volume this time i will not lose the screen capture for this i don't know how that happened in the first video you guys and i am so sorry about that and it really was just it, ah, i don't know why i can't work technology sometimes and yeah but anyway we're gonna do this with rocket i <laughs> i actually really really like the photos they chose i like these photos yeah anyway let's do this let's go Sorry. Did you do down when it got to Renjo's part. It just... Dun, dun, dun. Okay. okay, this see, this song seems very, very dream to me. Like, every... I've, even though NCT as a whole has, like, kind of, like, their, like, their sound and... If you've listened to anything, honestly, NCT, you'll understand that. Um, and I even, I feel like each individual unit, even, like, if they just, they have their particular style. It, I understand it may not make sense, but to me, this song is very dream. And I really like that, because I feel very nostalgic listening to it, like I'm listening to some of their older music. I don't know, and I just really like that. <laughs> Ooh. 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 Ooh.
sours. Yeah. Since I get like say. <laughs> okay, that's cute. Yeah. Since I get like say. I like that the whole universe is a stage below our feet, gravity beyond the limit, babe. But I really like that lyric. That's the second time I've seen it now. I like that in the background, even though you can hear Chandler's voice very clearly, the background, like that melody that's in the back, it's slowly picking up. And it's because it sounds like it's like almost in a foggy haze, and as it picks up, it becomes more clear. I like that. Let's meet in a different dimension, babe. Let's meet in a completely different dimension, babe. Nobody can handle us now. That would make sense. That would trace back to the um, the Star Wars reference and stuff like that. Being in a different dimension, being in a different galaxy, things like that. Okay. Okay. Again, this feels very, very NCT dream to me, and I actually really like that. I enjoyed that. It Honestly, I I felt this sense of nostalgia while I was listening to it, but also this sense of like youthfulness, which is kind of funny to me because the entire like concept for Dream in the beginning was to cater to the youth and to have that feeling as I was listening to the song was actually really, really nice for me. And yes, now can I say it's a song I would listen to very often? Probably not. Um, It is a very easy to listen to song, so, song, so, so, so. So, song, so, which I genuinely appreciate. And yes, um, now in terms of the song itself, there were actually a lot of elements in which I really, really liked. Um, such as like hearing like that trumpet in the background. Now, honestly, it may not have even been a trumpet. I really don't know. Um, I'm gonna be honest. I don't really know the name of instruments. So what if it is not, I do apologize and yes. But hearing like those little bitty sounds that kind of like add into like the effect of the song because truthfully, I feel like it helps build the song up and then pull the song back in like certain sections. And honestly, as a listener and just, it just, as a person who likes music, it just, it makes me really happy because it helps pull me in in certain aspects. And I just, I don't know, I really, really appreciate that. And yes, and honestly, their vocals are always beautiful. It's kind of crazy. I feel like their vocals have grown so much and 
they sound they honestly they just sound so really just so good i was gonna say really good and then so good and my brain got confused at which one to go with but they do they really do sound really good um and yeah i will say this something that i thought was kind of funny um the song in itself is titled rocket um and there were certain lyrics within the song in which they were talking about basically like the rocket taking off which i thought was kind of ironic because there are like different aspects of a rocket taking off um in different mvs such as one of theirs as well as wavy's takeoff and things like that so i just i don't know i found that like a weird connection even though it's not necessarily a connection i just i saw it and i was just like hmm okay and yeah i don't know but yeah anyway whatever we're not gonna go into the next one i'm sorry i i don't think that made sense but it did to me so <laughs> that's what counts Yes. Um, but anyway, we are now going to move to our next song, which is titled Countdown 321. And yes, let me pull this up, you guys, and make sure we're good. And yes, oh, uh, we are on a different set of photos now. Kind of, I think. Maybe. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. We are. Ooh, I like these photos. Okay. Anyway, let's go ahead and do this. Let's begin. Okay, <laughs> let's do this. Oh, that's not the button. What time it is, this gonna be. Who is giggling in the background? You heard that? Yeah, you know what time it is. This one's gonna be explosive. I'm the group of Jim and Gunji Boys. Rocked out your body, good day, gotch. You got all the mother show. Do you hear me? Hold on, nope, 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 nope. Pause! Why aren't you pausing? Shh! Go back! This. Yeah, you know what time it is. This one's gonna be explosive. I'm a group of Jim and Gunji Boys. Rocked out your body, good day, gotch. You got all the mother show is ready. Top floor, dig a sky, gotcha. We all ready. I wasn't expecting that beat change. Dig a sky, gotcha. We all ready. In the background? Uh, kind of sounds like Haitian, but I don't know. Fucking Haitian's vocals. to continue but it didn't it slowed down for Chandler okay Ooh, da, 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 in the background like four times at this point what is going on Three seconds. Why did you sing sound slightly? Just, just a little. Nope. Never mind. Never mind. He sounds like someone's, and I just, I can't think of their name. I can't think of their name. Oh my god. He, he's reminding me of a different person at the current moment. And they're in NCT. I can't think of their name. 
Oh my god, Jayon! Oh my god! Oh my god, why can't I think of Jayon's name? Why does she think so like Jayon right there? Jesus Christ. <laughs> this is gonna bother me. Is it here? I rewound too far, I'm sorry. Is it here? it when we went to the tick tick part the tick tick but we also got beautiful vocals in this and that beat kept changing and just it fluctuating up oh <laughs> oh my god okay i think this might be my favorite song out of this like section that we're listening to because honestly i really like that 
Don't get me wrong, I have no idea where the fuck this song was going in terms of lyrics. However, the beat itself, that playfulness that we got with the speed up, the speed down, it goes up and then it stops and then like it's like a brief second before the beat comes back. And <laughs> hearing all of that kind of play together, the ad-libs in the background, those harmonizations, it was just beautiful. Honestly, wow. I wasn't expecting. Okay, listen, I'm dumb. Every time I say this, I'm not expecting. I have been an end citizen for long enough that... I should know to expect the unexpected. I should know, like, excuse me. I should know the group well enough at this point where I'm not sitting here being like, God, what is about to happen? I should know at least, like, some, like, inkling that, girl, they're about to go off. Like, I should know this by now. I'm just dumb. I swear to you, I am. Wow. Okay, no. But seriously, again, I have no idea what was happening within this. I was trying to pay attention to the lyrics, but hearing just the vocals, the pure vocals, I I really like their vocals. And I'm hoping that they did a live stage of this at some point when they were promoting this album. Because truthfully, I feel like that there could have been a really good dance break somewhere within this. Especially when that beat goes up and then completely changes before it comes back down. I definitely feel like I could see a dance break in there. And I want to see what they would do with it, how they would play with it. I know they did a handful of live stages for this album. Um, so hopefully I am going to... I'm so sorry, Freotic. I am assuming that they did one at some point and I'm definitely gonna have to check because I am incredibly curious and yes. And wow, okay, so I really like that one. I really like that one. Uh, but now we are gonna move to our last one, which is titled ANL. What the heck does ANL stand for? Why is Renjun eating a piece of bread in this photo? Chamala looks 12. She just has three pair of glasses on. Okay. Chaos. Makes sense. Yes. Anyway, let's do this. Let's go with ANL. Let's go. Ooh. What? Oh, wait. I really like how this starts. Okay. Oh, his voice is so incredibly light right here. I really like Rinjin. Okay, first of all, this is Rinjin's era. First of all, man dyed his hair two different colors, became a different man. Love it. We love to see it. what it stands for. Duh. Um, the vocals of this. That beat though, that song. So we got more 
Mark Vogel's and Mark Rapping, okay? <laughs> but to hear it pull away completely and then Renjun's vocals come in beautiful beautiful That we got from Mark, the like a little bit more like slightly aggressive one that we got from Jano. Everything kind of just came together so incredibly beautiful. And this song is honestly so sweet. Like truly.